Hello students. Today I'm going to teach you how to record your screen. So the program we're going to use is Screencastify and you're going to find it in Google Extension. So the first thing we have to do is open Google and go to your Google Drive and then click New and scroll down and go to more and then scroll all the way down until you get to connect more apps right there and then you're going to type in screen and there it is screen castify video editor that's what you're looking for so I'm going to click that and then I'm going to click it here and I'm going to add it to my drive. So you're just gonna click that. Mine is already added, but you are going to have a different, it'll be probably a blue button or a green button and you just click it. And then once you click it, you will be able to see it up here, okay? And I have a lot of things up here, so I have to click these three little dots right here these are all my Google extensions. So if I click the three little dots, there it is right there. This is Screencastify, and these are all my other Google extensions. So I click Screencastify, and then if I want to record, I just click Record. But first, I'm going to get something I want to record. So for example, if I'm doing a report, I'm going to look for a report that I want to grade, or I want to read. So here's a report. Okay, so here's a report on amphibians. So I want to record myself reading this report online, okay? So here's the report, all right? And I have to click Screencastify before I click Present. All right, so now I'm going to go over here. Okay, I'm going to open Screencastify. And then I'm going to click record. And then it's going to ask me which screen I want. I'm gonna click this screen and I'm gonna click share. And now it's recording. So then what I can do is I can go over here and click present. And there is my presentation. And now I can just read. Hello, my name is Miss Hood and I'm doing my presentation on amphibians. The amphibian I'm doing is called the mantilla. Physical characteristics of the mantilla. They are small, up to two inches long, up to two pounds, and their color is yellow, bright orange, orange, and red. They have two big black eyes, a long mouth, and four limbs. Their skin is viscous. Here is a picture of the mantilla. This is its anterior side, and this is its posterior side. And these are all the parts of the mantilla. This is the reproduction of the mantilla. Here are the eggs inside its belly, and here are the eggs outside of its belly. The mantilla lays 10 to 100 eggs, and it takes two to six days to hatch. The mantilla are tadpoles, and it takes 45 to 360 days for the tadpoles to metamorphosize. The age of, matur of maturity is 12 to 14 months. The habitat of the mantilla. Mantillas are found only in Madagascar, on the eastern coast of Africa. And here's a picture of Madagascar and here's the eastern coast of Africa. The 
diet of the mantilla. They are carnivores, feeding on termites, fruit flies, ants, and huge range of other insects, but they can't eat butterflies. Behavior of the mantilla. They can jump and swim. They are calm. They sound like ribbit ribbit. The lifespan of the mantilla. Mantillas live in the wild for eight years and they live in captivity for five years. Mantillas are endangered. How does climate change affect the mantilla? Climate change is affecting the mantilla because mantilla populations are small and the slightest problem or mildest pollutant can be enough to completely wipe out the species. Interesting facts. Mantilla have long tongues to, in, to eat insects. They have greasy feet to grip and their skin is toxic to protect themselves. Thank you for listening. So then what you do, when you're done with your presentation, you click exit, and then you go up here and you find the Screencastify, and then you click stop. And then it's going to show you your video, and you can click this to listen. turn off the volume and you want to I'm going to put a title on this okay and I would call it animal report okay and I would put mantilla All right, and then I share it to Google Classroom. And then I go over here and I go to my class. So whatever class you have to turn it in, if you're ELD one reading, you would turn it in here. If you're ELD two reading, you would turn it in here, ELD three whatever class you have the assignment in, and I did an example so I can show you how to do it. So the assignment that I have to turn it into would be the animal presentation. So I'm gonna click animal presentation, and then I click go, and there it is. And then I attach it, And then I'm going to view it in Google Classroom to make sure I turned it in. And there it is. There's my animal.